Hey what's up everyone, as a starter for creating YouTube videos, para sa akin, ito yung best bang for the buck 4K video editing system. Tara, tingnan natin. So, for quite some time, um, nakakapag-upload ako ng YouTube videos, but I'm using my AMD system, which is an AMD A10 uh, CPU um, for video editing using Adobe Premiere. For 1080p uh, videos, uh, this is enough, but uh, the, the problem is, uh, pag 4K uh, videos na, I'm, an, I'm able to render it, pero hindi ko ma-playback ma when using Adobe Premiere. So, yun yung lang li limitation. Although, uh, this one uh, is already decent for a beginner like me. Meron na siyang 24GB uh, uh, RAM and SSD na rin yung hard drive niya. But again, yun nga, in terms of um, uh, processing, uh, video editing processing using um, Adobe Premiere, medyo bottleneck yung CPU. So, I decided to upgrade the CPU, motherboard, and the RAM. And the other parts are, are uh, scrap coming from my old system. So, uh, let's start for the video card. I'm using the scrap uh, part which is a GeForce GTX 1050 Ti. For the CPU, um, initially, I'd like the Intel uh, 9700K, pero medyo pricey siya. So I decided to use Ryzen 7. This is the uh, 27, uh, 2700X. So unlock siya. 8 core, 16 uh, thread processor. Okay. So ang base clock nito is uh, 3.7 gigahertz. Okay. So again, the AMD Ryzen 7, meron na siyang uh, cooler na kasama. Okay. For the, the RAM, uh, previously I already had 24 gig. Uh, right now I decided a Corsair Vengeance uh, 3000 megahertz uh, clock speed DDR4 RAM. So this is uh, 32 gig in all. This one is 16 gig. Another 16 for dual channel. So 32 gig na siya. Okay. Now for the motherboard. I decided to use the ASUS ROG Strix uh, B450 uh, chipset. Okay, so this is uh, for me the best bang for the buck uh, motherboard for this uh, Ryzen um, Ryzen uh, CPU. So this uh, this would uh, accept the first generation and the second generation uh, generation Ryzen CPUs. And for the Power supply, I used a scrap uh, part which is the Silverstone uh, Strider Series 600 watts. Okay, and for for the uh, CPU case, I used the uh, Silverstone uh, PS14 Precision uh, Tower uh, CPU case. So again, uh, that's it, guys. So for me, uh, this is the best bang for the buck. Uh, video uh, 4k video editing uh, machine na para sa mga youtube uh, starter or anyone who would like to edit uh, videos pero starter lang and you don't have enough uh, budget okay so again uh, 1050 ti graphics card ryzen 7 2700x 32 gig um, corsair vengeance the asus rog strix b450e motherboard and a 600 watts processor and I used some uh, scrap parts uh, from my older machine so that's it guys um, I'm going to build this and uh, show you later the um, after assembling the machine Now for enough storage, nag-add ako ng uh, Seagate Iron Wolf uh, 6 terabytes uh, hard drive uh, NAS, uh, NAS hard drive. It's a NAS hard drive, so I'll be storing most of my files here. So additional shadows existing ko 
na 4 terabyte uh, uh, hard drive NAS. So ayan guys, um, I was able to complete the setup. I'll just be testing it, uh, but for sure, it's a big upgrade from uh, my existing uh, video editing PC, which is an AMD A10 with uh, 24 gigabyte. So this time, I opted to um, upgrade to Ryzen 7 2700X 32 uh, gig RAM, and uh, the rest are uh, scrap uh, uh, parts. So. See you.